What's up guys, welcome back to Modded RimWorld. Apologies, this is going to be going up a little bit late today. Um, I just, after that that awesome stream we had last night, I was super tired. I got Vanilla RimWorld recorded and I just, I wasn't really having fun while playing it. So, I didn't want to do this. Because you guys can definitely tell when I'm not having fun. So, um, I mean, I know I can tell. So, I, I didn't want to, I didn't want to record it. So, I got up, I'm recording this. Hopefully, YouTube decides to process it quickly. Um, if it doesn't then I am sorry for that. But it will be up as soon as it possibly can be. Let's go ahead and get to work. We're going to terraform this area, um, which means deconstructing all of the things. So that will happen. Um, and I noticed I just messed up my power conduit, so I'm going to have to redo that right there, which will be fine. What are we researching? Bionics. Okay. All right, well, hopefully this all works. I think I'll need a support. I'm gonna cancel that. I think I'll need a support for this room. Messed up the power. <laughs> That's okay. What do we got? Cargo pods. Uh, some iguana meat. Not too bad. It's a little bit of a ways up there, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, we need colonist beds. It'll get fine as soon as you guys decide to build beds. And we're going to see if maybe we can anger some tribals this episode. That way we can start getting some biomatter back. See how that treats us. And I think... I'm pretty sure we're going to need a support. So let's... Right there next to this one, next to that rock. Structure, slate support, there we go. Now we should be, we should be okay. Once all that gets going. So we got a lot of fur back, or a lot of leather rather. Got some wood back, that's nice. And we now have this lovely space that we can hopefully terraform. Let's check out our our things, our situation, our work situation. I feel like we need more growers, so I kind of want to put more people on growing. Um, happy, happy cooks though. Smoky Dan, I don't want you to cook at all. I want you to to get the crafting. Clean after crafting, please. HCN is in charge of hauling and cleaning, so HCN will take care of it. So you craft. Um, Rabbit Jake is a cook, which is fine. He's a good cook. We need to keep him going. Tuopi is growing, and then tailoring. We'll put we'll put you on cooking. Tim, no. We'll see how this goes for right now. Actually, I want to take I want to take Gecko and Hunter off of research and HCN off of research. So just Ghost Father and Endovier will be handling that whenever they get time. Smokey Dan gonna go grab some iguana meats. We're doing pretty well on food. Everything seems like it's working out pretty well. So we're gonna drop some terraformers in this area. See how that goes. Um, Zergum is slowly slowly growing. We keep having the power outages which is unfortunate. It keeps dying. Um, and I'm pretty sure we're running low or out of seeds for Zeragum at this point. So we really need these to hold. Uh, maybe we should go ahead and get the shielding next. That would probably be useful. Let's go ahead and haul things away. So yeah, we had a we had a pretty fun stream last night. It was definitely entertaining. There were rockets everywhere. Um, unfortunately, someone died. But... It was for a good cause, because rockets? I don't know. Uh, so yeah, thank you everyone for coming out. We had some fun. Uh, I'll be doing it again on on Thursday, so I guess tomorrow. Um, same time, 7 p.m. Eastern time. I believe it's like minus four GMT right now because of daylight savings. I'm not I'm not 100% certain, but you should be able to just Google time zone converter uh, if you're if you're needing to know. Uh, so yeah. 
7 p.m. Eastern. I'll probably just go to 10 p.m. Eastern because last night it seemed like people wanted to stick around a little bit longer than the 9. So, uh, yeah, we'll do three-hour streams on Tuesday and Thursday from now on. And then eventually, I'll probably do a, a Sunday stream that's three or four hours long. Um, and if you guys want to see anything other than RimWorld, definitely let me know and I can make sure I have stuff installed. Um, on the next stream, I'll probably just show my Steam library, scroll through it, and you guys can see uh, what I have and what you would like me to install to play. But yeah, last night we just did like two and a half hours of RimWorld and it was a ton of fun. Got a nice little area playing with zombies. Um, those videos are going to be up soon after this one uh, gets, like after I finish recording it, I have to uh, trim the stream I'm gonna cut it down into like hour-long episodes and see how that goes I just remembered in Dovier, I'm sorry I forgot to call the exotic goods trader I'm sorry about that you guys have medicine that's all you have I'm not interested in that combat supplier I'm not really interested in anything you have I guess we could get a Barrett what's the range on this it's 47 A Swedish Snap Hance. A Snap Hance or Snap Haunts as a type of lock for a firing gun for firing a gun or as a gun using that mechanism. The name is Dutch in origin, but the mechanism cannot be attributed to the Netherlands with certainty. It's the mechanical pro progression of the wheel lock firing system. Well that's fine. Uh, this medicine's actually pretty cheap. We'll buy some of this medicine instead. Not not well, well yeah, we'll go with that. I've seen the power of cookie trading. Um, I've been I've been warned that in other versions of the mod, uh, it's not as OP or lucrative. But yeah, let's go ahead and get solar solar shielding. Yes, um, but in this version of the mod, it is apparently quite lucrative. So we'll have that going for us. This area is all nice and set up. Let's go ahead and see if we can set a terraformer in here. Terraformers cannot be placed under a roof. This says it's unroofed. Oh, it's because of everything else being open. And everyone has malaria. That is super awesome. Can I... Can I unroof this? Nope. Okay, so we can't terraform. <laughs> we can't terraform in here, unfortunately. Um... I guess the next best thing is going to be hydroponics. So we'll put a... We're going to have to do two lamps in here. Which kind of sucks because it's... We're not going to be... We're overlapping the lamps a little bit. But it should be alright. Um, actually, what do we need for aquaponics? Maybe instead of doing... Uh, the, f the hydroponics in here, we can do aquaponics. Let's do one of each, I guess. Let's let's cancel a sun lamp. We'll cancel this sun lamp. We'll build this one. We'll build some hydroponics up here and then some aquaponics down here. Just for the just for the time being. See how that goes. I really want these guys to live. All right, what do we need for we need this AI chip right here. This AI chip is supposed to help with dementia. It's supposed to remove it completely. Uh, so we need two of them. We need one for Amea and we need one for Happy. We need biomatter and... Okay, we need gold. So we have to find some gold. Is there gold? Do we do we have any gold visible on the map anywhere? That's silver? Kind of want that silver. Are we pretty good on meat? We're not the greatest on meat. We could go out here and hunt some deer don't get dark I'm looking for gold it's a building here okay I guess we'll look for gold later <laughs> and ghost father is starving ah I forgot to set up all the extra doctors someone someone can do this HCN, go feed Ghost Father. I mean, you have malaria. It's not like you're incapable of walking. You can go get your own food, Ghost. I'm just saying. Can you feed him? 
Yeah, there you go. It's a nice loving relationship. You guys, you guys feed each other. Don't feed him a cookie, he's sick. Feed him, like, some soup or something. We have cans of soup. Feed him a can of soup. Soup! <laughs> Alright, so unfortunately we can't terraform, which makes me sad. Uh, and Dovier is now starving. And Dovier is going to go eat some food. He's going to eat a cookie. Awesome. Smokey Dan, well, you can go eat food. I'm not... I'm not stopping any of you from eating food. You are the one stopping yourselves from eating food. Okay. Let's, uh, while we're at it, let's change out the walls. We'll get those going. Um, and then we also need to expand out our crafting area, so we'll do that in a moment as well. We should have, we do have 25 chips, that's good. What are we making from the smithing table? Just the chips. I'll go ahead and turn off the smithing table for right now. Um, and this guy we can go ahead and turn off as well. Just to try to make sure we save on power. We are going to be getting the sun lamp soon, so that's going to be uh, a, big, a bit of a strain on our power. How many? We have 600 steel bars, just about. So we should be able to get a couple hydroponics and fishies going. Not many, but a couple. Um, I want to make sure we get all the silver. Let's go ahead and get that silver while we can. While it's nice and safe, is there any gold up here that, I, that I've missed? I don't think so. We may have to purchase some gold. I didn't see any gold. If you guys saw any gold, be sure to let me know, please. And it looks like we're going to need more graves soon, or at least uh, something to cremate them with. Well, we need more beds in here. <laughs> we have cloth. That's good. Um, well, actually, we have this built already, so we had we had plenty of cloth. Winter has begun. Uh, that means we're going to need to get some, some coolers up. Or not coolers, some heaters up. Why would we need coolers, guys? You guys are silly. Now, I don't think any of this heat is going to get stored up once I put the vents in. But we'll see how it goes. We'll go ahead and put in a slate, slate vent. I guess back here. Put one in right here. Once that gets built, uh, we'll put in another one here, I guess. See how that goes. Would like to get one up here as well. And mostly I'm putting in multiple ones just to inconvenience people uh, if they ever decide they want to break in. Then they'll have to break through multiple vents which are at least a little bit durable. Deer Revenge? That's awkward. That is super awkward. Our base is nice and colorful with all the mushrooms. Thank you little mushrooms. Thank you so much. Amea, go get go get treatment. There there are beds available. Go rest. Are you hot, HCN? You're hot? I'm sorry. It is a little warm in here. It actually warmed up a lot. Is it because I I put those vents in? That's what's going on. Yep. Get one more, and then we'll we'll research uh, as soon as this finishes. We'll research the uh, smart vents. That way they can regulate air better. All right, are you guys tribals? 
No, you're not tribals. And Dovier, go talk with them. Maybe they want some cookies. Be sure to ask if they want cookies. Do they want cookies? Why do you not want cookies? We're going to buy a few more Zeragum seeds just because we're losing a lot of them uh, from the power outages. And I want to make sure we have them. Um, I'll go ahead and sell the t-shirt. No, I won't. I don't know when we'll ever get another one made. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I think that's going to be it. We're just going to buy these seeds. Get a conduit wall going. Alright. It is actually retaining more heat. This is still staying, staying around the same temperature though, so that should be alright. But we definitely need to get this stuff finished. Really need this research finished. But Endovier is sick in bed. And is now eating a cookie. And is now sick in bed. <laughs> And is now researching again. Okay. I know the vents are really quick to make. Or to research, that is. So, that shouldn't be too big of a problem. Well, I mean, at least it's nice and warm in here. It's 47 outside. It's 100 in here. It's a little too warm. This area is doing much better. All right, there we go. Let's get air circulation. Let's see what we need for these solar flare generator thingies. Miscellaneous? Is it is it under here? Do I see it? I don't see it. Maybe it's not this. Security. No. Um, was it under miscellaneous and I didn't see it? Production? This area looks larger. Well, they have the Bionics workbench now. Uh, which we're going to wait on for a while. <laughs> I want power. Magnetic shield protects colony from solar flare at tremendous power cost and generates huge amounts of heat when in operation. You can build more than one. Having several active is useless and will only create more something. Do we want to do this? It generates tremendous amounts of heat. I don't think we want to right now. I, I think we'll we'll just have to wait a little bit. Buddy, there's a bed in here, Rabbit Jake. There, there's a bed in here. Alright, you guys need to get over this malaria thing because we have work that needs to get done. I know that sounds kind of heartless, but at the same time, we have work that needs to get done. What is all this stuff? Wooden foot, dentures, peg legs, eye patches. Acceptable. That is acceptable. Alright, that research is almost finished. None of this is getting mined. Everyone is sick. And it's annoying me. So, so much. go guys let's get it let's get it researched go team go team I guess we could just put a door here that would help out with the heat do I need two doors here no but do I want two doors here kind of okay we finished that all right that's good Let's get a... Uh, what does this do? It lets us make med kits. Let's get a chem lab, because we're going to need some medicine soon. And let's go ahead and get some active vents. Orange goes on the side that you would like to control. Get a few of those beasties in there. And then we should be sorted. actually going to get quite a bit hotter. We 
because this was heating up all of this section, or dispersing the heat through all of that. HCN is broken and in a daze. Why? You were treating ghost, and you just, you just gave up. So I can't do this anymore. I can't bandage him anymore. Well, I'm sorry. We need to expand this area still. We still need some of this stuff mined out though. All right, this, uh, you can let it get up to about, we'll say 76. It got quite a bit hotter in here. Hopefully our our freezers will be doing okay. I might actually deconstruct both of these vents and just have the one. Or actually just deconstruct them, period. Well, no, because this will actually let us keep part of the base warm. Our coolers are still staying nice and chilly. A blight has destroyed our crops. Excellent. Glad I bought those Zergum seeds. <laughs> Alright. Conduit walls for everyone. Let's, uh, let's haul things first. Crafted goods trader. What do you guys have for us? You guys have... Uh, nothing that I'm interested in at the moment. Smokey Dan is finally making some kindling and filling up all the wrong places. Someone haul these, please. Thank you, HCN. Can someone else? Ghost, can you? You're not a hauler. Happy. Happy can haul stuff. Happy haul this one. I want that one specifically hauled. That way I can do this. Alright. Well, unfortunately we can't terraform this area, which kind of makes me a little bit sad. Uh, but that's that's okay, I guess. Them's, them's the breaks. Um, we will put in a couple of hydroponics areas up here. Um, they each take a hundred. I'm not gonna be like min-maxing this area either. I like to make sure people have room to walk. So we're gonna put in a couple of these, or four of those rather, and we're also gonna get an aquaponics area. We'll get, uh, we'll get a couple of these. I know we're gonna run out of stuff for it. These also need hoppers. Maybe I should double these up. But that'll that would interfere with the uh, this area up here. So I don't want to do that. So I'm fine with doubling these up. We'll put we'll put some hoppers next to them. Get those going. I think I want to grow. Let's grow some coffee. Let's get these guys some coffee going. We need to get Omnijail seeds soon. All of this has now worked out. Our base is staying relatively warm. Okay, tribals, that's good. We can anger the tribals. Once they set up, we're going to go for them. Um, over here, let's grow some Zeragum next to the coffee just because these guys, they're not, they're not going to work out. I'm going to deconstruct these. We'll do something else with this. We may just expand it. Uh, and then use this as another workshop area. We could use this as storage for any bionics that we have. Uh, bulk resources trader. Okay, those guys are set up. Let's call these guys. Do you want to buy cookies? You do. Cookies. Super OP. Look at that. 1,500 silver for 200 cookies. It's so good. Alright, do we want to buy anything from you? Probably not. At least not at the moment. I want to maybe get some advanced materials or possibly a new recruit or something so we'll get that um, and then we're gonna we're gonna grab these guys rabbit Jake Smokey Dan flying gecko HCN ghost father and hunter you guys could all come forward 
And if you could go ahead and start shooting at him. Now, from what I've seen, and I've done this before, none of these people are going to get mad. They are going to... Uh, their faction... Okay, never mind, I lied to you. I lied to you. They'll get mad. Yes, bad will. Good. Don't flee. We need you. We want you. I feel kind of bad about that. Stop shooting, he's dead. Hunter's just like, bang, bang. <laughs> Alright, so if you guys could uh, capture Buffalo and capture Trobo, hopefully we'll get some new recruits in. Uh, you guys can go about your business. Excellent. Now we have some biomatter coming in. Need to make sure we strip these guys. Got some extra steel bars coming in. What do you guys need for food? Okay, you take you take vegetables. That's fine. We have plenty of those. All right, awesome. So we have buffalo. Health-wise, you are missing a foot and a nose. That's not good. And trobo should be all right-ish. So let's go ahead and just try to recruit them. Um, it'll at least hopefully give us a little bit of skill. We'll even give you guys a little bit of medicine. Just to make sure that you live long enough. And let's see what we need for this chem lab. Um, we did get the chem lab, right? Or is that... Okay, we're almost done with the chem lab. We'll get that in a moment. Growing coffee, growing some zeragum. We have some carrots in here to feed the fishies once we get some fishies going. Need a little bit more steel bars to get that up and running. Cargo pods. Power. Okay, let's get a uh, let's get some lighted slate walls in here. Put one here, one here. Conduit walls, an idle aquaponics basin. Well, how do we how do we do this? Bills, supply eggs. Okay, we need eggs. How do we get eggs? Mash gone. Supply some eggs of mash gone to breed. You only need to do it. When there is no fish in the basin or you want to change the red species. Uh, well, I want... I don't want tail teeth. Let's do mash gone in one. Uh, do it do it one time. And then this one will do the... Was it the blue fin or something? Boom rat leather. Leather is always nice, especially when it's close to our base. Alright, so now we need some steel bars. Waiting on this to get made. Just kidding, it's ready. Uh, blue blade. Let's get some blue blade going. It, it doesn't. It doesn't want to. Okay. Well, let's let's do blue blade here, and let's do mash gone here. I don't know where we're gonna get the the eggs from. Maybe we need to go fishing for the eggs and catch like a, a mother fish or something and get some row out of it perhaps we'll see how that goes how much power do you take 500 that takes a lot of power buffalo's grumpy uh, we finished the chem lab I wanna well that's right in this version you can't forbid doors <laughs> the spotlights like I see you buffalo <laughs> That's good. Okay, um, we need to figure out how to get some eggs. I, I'm guessing we need to fish them. If someone could let me know in the comments how to get eggs, that would be great. Like I said, I'm assuming we need to maybe go fishing, and then whenever we butcher, we might get some roe or something like that. That could be good. Uh, we also need to get steel. Or not steel, we need gold. We definitely need some gold. You guys are sleeping here. You're not tribals, are you? No, you're not tribals. Um, we still have a lot of work to do. We still have a lot of work to do. <laughs> we have a lot of walls we need to replace. Still need to expand this area out. I forgot to do that. But we'll go ahead and get that going. Um, we'll expand this out a little bit. Probably move the loom. Bring our stockpile over some. And... I guess continue working on replacing the walls in the main living area. Still have to get the floor situation sorted out. Uh, I'm just not really sure what type of floors I want to put in everywhere. This also needs 
I guess it doesn't technically need a conduit wall, but I'll do it just to have it. Back up on steel bars. Rimwolf Revenge on Eddie. I'm sorry, Eddie. Eddie's dead, though. Eddie brought us a Webley. It's a revolver. I like Webleys. Is it a good quality Webley? Can I just can I just see it without... Okay. It's a normal quality Webley. Uh, the wolf is taking off towards our base, I believe. Maybe. Where is Endovier? Endovier is going to go get Eddie. Good. Everything worked out. Tuopi is going to go get the revolver, I'm assuming. Buffalo is not grumpy anymore. Well, I guess there's that. I think I'm going to... Yeah, let's do this. We'll run a power conduit down here and then put in a lighted wall. That way you guys have a little bit of light. Good times. Uh, everyone's throwing up everywhere. That's not good times, though. It's the opposite of good times. Power situation is still doing pretty well. Um, we still need to get some eggs, which I guess means we need to go build a uh, fishing area. Fishing pier? Production. Fishing pier. Let's get... Let's get it. Let's get it going. Fishing pier. Alright, so we'll get one of those up. Um, and I think that's probably going to wrap up the episode. Unfortunately, we have to go so far away to get the fishing going. Um, and I'm worried that this wolf... I'm going to say I'm to get hunted. As well as this wolf. I know they usually attack, but hopefully... HCN will be okay. Okay, HCN's fine. Smokey Dan. Smokey Dan. Smokey Dan. You're not doing as great as I thought you would. Are you gonna be okay? I feel like this wolf is winning this fight. Cargo pods. What's going on up here? Some meat. Excellent. Uh, where were we? We were up here. Smokey Dan was the victor. If you could hunt him, though, that would be excellent. There we go. Are you okay? Are you missing more fingers? No, you just got some scratches. That's alright. Well, we got lots of meat. We got lots of food. We're going to have coffee soon. Hopefully we're going to get some zero gum soon. Uh, we need to research some stuff because we had that chem lab, go chem lab going and now we have that done. Uh, it's been suggested that I work on getting some droids. Could definitely do that. Uh, the pod, I believe this was something about trees. Vancidium refinery so we can make some Vancidium. That could be useful. Um, an Avenger turret. Cremation. Let's get... Let's get the cremation going, just because I feel like we need to get rid of, we need to clear out our graveyard some. Uh, and then after that, we'll see about getting some droids. And this fishing pier will get done, hopefully. Hunter's going to go work on it. Excellent. No. Hunter. <laughs> you were doing so great. Fishing pier. Bills. Okay. Uh, make a fishing rod. 20 wood, 10 cloth, and 10 steel ore. We can we can swing that. We'll make a fishing rod. Um, it's weird that you have to do this here, but that's alright. Does that mean someone has to equip the fishing rod? Because that would kind of irritate me. But we'll see how it goes, I guess. <laughs> Hopefully I'll remember to check that. I think that's going to wrap up this episode. Again, I'm sorry that it's going to be going up a little bit late. Um, and then soon, the, soon after this is up, the videos from the Twitch stream will be up as well. And again, I'll be streaming uh, tomorrow night, Thursday, from... Oh, we had a fault in our circuit. It's not nice. Um, again, I'll be streaming tomorrow night, uh, 7 p.m. Eastern to probably around 10 p.m. Eastern, something like that. Uh, yeah, so hopefully you guys will join me because we had a ton of fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to put up a fuse box 
real quick. And then that's going to be it for me. As always, thanks for watching, and have a good one.